Here's celebrate the final morning show of Hot 98 FM, radio personalities did some wild and crazy things. Although the station was bought out by Sorensen Pacific Broadcasting, the staff says they look forward to a new era. It was a bittersweet morning for employees at Saipan's hottest rock and roll radio station, Hot 98 FM. After being on the air for eight years, the station broadcasted its final morning show. Coincidentally, morning radio personality Shane Novak celebrated his birthday. To ensure Hot 98 listeners were left with a lasting impression, radio personality Skip Jack Stevens coordinated a day full of fun and surprise. Well, this morning we, we, we uh, had um, a cake for him. It was brought in by Ramon Mangsese, actually Ramon Mangsese's likeness. You can come back to the studio and see it if you like. And um, then um, he had a massage from Mona Lisa's Dream, came in and gave him a very nice <laughs> shot. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> You're starting a trend here. And, uh, it was, and then we just took him out wakeboarding on BC Sun Sports. Since Hot 98 listeners couldn't actually see Shane wakeboarding this morning, KMCV7 News has video to prove it. To celebrate the actual the final morning show of Hot 98, we uh, put together a little uh, little on-air dog and pony show here and came out in the compliments of BC Sun Sports. I did some nude wakeboarding here. Um, we had uh, some lovely Chinese girls come in the studio and I was massaged from head to toe. And... Novak, Skip Jack Stevens and the full Monty promised the listening audience of Saipan will continue to be treated with great rock and roll. Only now the station will be called The Rock 97.9. It's going to be, uh, we're having kind of a, a soft opening with it uh, next week and uh, uh, the format's going to change, stay the same. As far as I know, rock and roll. I mean, this is it's been a rock station, and it's going to be even a better rock station. Well, it's just the end of an era, and now into a new new phase of, of rock and roll and uh, radio in Saipan. And uh, we wish it much success and uh, hope that uh, we can continue rocking and rolling the CNMI like nobody else. Sword Pacific Broadcasting, you know, they own several stations in, in Guam, so they, they know what they're doing. And you've got uh, the support now of a large broadcasting entity, which is going to bring a top-notch sound here to, uh, to the island. So, again, the, the consumer is going to benefit from it. Basically, it's been a great run, seven years, Hot 98 on the air, seven years, right? And uh, the only rock station, we've got a great following of people. Thank you very much for listening. And we're also looking forward to the new rock station, which is coming up. And keep it tuned in, find out what's going on. The Rock 97.9 will celebrate its soft opening beginning Monday morning. Coming up next, Hopwood Hoopsters dare dare to beat them. Bob has that story after the break.